Hi guys, it's Cassidy, and um, a few days ago I had to present a video to my biology class. Um, it was for a project. I did it on the morals and ethics of genetic engineering, and I basically was just looking up like arguments about people thought it was right or wrong, and I kind of all made it into a skit and kind of they kind of talked about all the arguments in it, and I have to present that to the class, and then like everyone really liked it and. Even before I presented it, I felt really proud of the video, and I don't know, it was kind of different than the usual videos I make, and I want to make more like it, so I just decided I was going to upload it today and share it with you guys, so yeah, that's what you guys are about to watch. <laughs> oh my god, did she really say that? Oh my god, wait, did he say that too? Oh my god! Oh my gosh! It's so funny! <laughs> Hello, how are you this morning? I just got back from 6 a.m. mass. It was so, so lovely. Did you attend? I have a very personal relationship with our Lord Jesus Christ, so I go to mass every single day, and I always just feel so good after. You should go sometime. It's so great, so, so, so great. Jesus is the way after all. Jesus loves me, this I know, for the Bible tells me so. <coughs> okay class, today we're going to be debating the ethics and genetics of genetic science. I've been talking about this a while, so I expect you all have something to say about it. So do we have any volunteers? Anybody, anybody? Okay, who else wants to go up? Norm, let's go. Can I not? Nope. Please? No. But Ruth, you're against Norm. Let's go, guys. I believe that Jesus, our Lord and our Father, made people the way they are. Why should we, just some earthly humans, change what he made? But if he if he's even real. He is. If he gave us the tools to do this and to make people's lives healthier and better, then we should take those tools and do it. God made us this way for a reason and we were created in his image. Okay, well not everyone believes that. If we have the chance to make our lives better, shouldn't we do that? If you had a daughter and you knew that she was going to be deformed when she was born, wouldn't you try to change it if you could? She would face such a hard life if she was deformed. She just wouldn't be able to do things that normal kids could do, and people would tease her about it, and it just sucks so much for her. I would love her the way she was made. I was given her for a reason, and she was made that way for a reason. But you can make her life so much better. And it'd be just her body that changed, not her soul. And isn't that what's most important to you? Isn't it just your soul, not your body? Yes, but... say she sh she was made that way for a reason and i will love her no matter what and all people should be loved like that too no matter what flaws they have they deserve love no matter what okay time's up thank you both no problem sir you need jesus so class did we learn anything new today oh, oh.